morning guys it's the uh, 2nd of February I haven't made a video in a while and we've got quite a bit of snow over the past two days we got uh, oh what was it 24 inches I believe 26 inches so and it was really windy last night too so it's been kind of a nuisance it's not that cold it's only 20 but it's not that bad out um, the thing is, is the snow plow and everything's covered. I'll show you that in a little bit. The deer have been coming around a lot. They're really hungry right now. I saw some laying in the snow over by the pipeline this morning when I uh, was plowing over there. Um, that's what I've been doing mostly the past couple of weeks is plowing every other day because we get two inches of snow. At night, two more inches, two more inches. Uh, just yesterday, oh, last night we got six. The day before that, we got um, 20, 20, I think. So, or 18, yeah, 18. So anyway, Sally and I have been doing good. Our winter's good. We've been no sickness or nothing like that. Um, you know, the winter's a little tough on you when you're older. Um, and that's what we're experiencing. We're just trying to get through the winter okay. Not having the chickens this year was good for us because we didn't have to be walking through that snow to all the way over there trying to get that taken care of. The good thing is that everything's running and that uh, there's really no headaches with nothing. I'll show you some more of the outside stuff as we go here. Well, you can see we got pretty much snow. Um, Earlier in the month, we had 28 inches, not February, but in January. And then we had rain and it kind of took it all away. Right now, we have about 30 inches or a little, about 30 inches of snow. Um, in most places, you know, some is higher or lower. The wind's been blowing the snow around and all kind of other stuff. But you know, like, I guess it'd be better to say we got even 20 probably 26 and 28 inches of snow yet and now I plowed this morning so you know it's been one of those things where it's been, plow I've been plowing almost every day because we've been getting a stupid inch or two of snow and if you leave it sit it turns into ice you know after you drive on it a while so I don't want that so anyway that's what the story is at the moment we're about to go into town we need a couple of things I don't know if I said it before or not. It's the 2nd of February, Tuesday, but um, I just want to get a couple things in town so we don't have to worry in case. We're supposed to get three more inches of snow and then a couple clear days and then snow again, so I'm not sure of how much. So as you can see outside here, we're piled up with snow all over the place and I got to get this out of here, some of it. I want I can get rid of that pile the stuff over by the backhoe and uh, other than that that's what we've been sort of fighting but I haven't made any videos because I haven't done any sharp, uh, sawing I did get a couple logs the other day and put them on the pile but they're buried now you can see what I'm saying about the snow covering everything even the even the uh, wood drying over there was covered in snow so anyway we just got to get through these next couple of days it's supposed to get a little sunny it doesn't say warmer though so I don't know if it's gonna get warmer or not but we do have a lot of snow yeah so I was I had to plow this road here and it's there's a lot of ice underneath this snow because of what we had gotten rain a couple of weeks ago, maybe a month or so ago, I guess, I guess, and that messed things up. But you can see that it's pretty much snow, though. I know you hear the squeakiness of the car and all, but I figured I'd just show you what the road's looking like here. It's actually good as far as driving because uh, the gas people have been plowing it really good. It's nice and wide, and they've been cindering it. Township doesn't do as good a job as that as what they're doing, but uh, it's coming up good. 
and they're supposed to be drilling three more wells here now. I thought they were done, but they're hitting a lot of gas, so they're gonna keep drilling. Last night I walked a dog down here, and right in the middle of the, over on that side, on the right-hand side there, there were five deer digging down through the snow, trying to get some grass for themselves. So we've been feeding the deer, but right now I gotta try and plow the road that I have to go down to where I feed them. And I'm gonna try to do that this afternoon. The other day when I was walking the dog, we went up that road that I, that driveway that I said I plowed a minute ago, and there were 22 deer standing up there. Now when I lived at the other end of the state, we could count 500 deer a night by going out and spotting when I was a kid. But I haven't seen this many deer in this area at one time like that before. So 22 of them were standing up on the pipeline. And what they were doing was um, they were eating the grass where the pipe is pump pumping gas because it's actually drying the, the ground. The ground, all the snow was melting where that pipe was. So they were able to eat there. That's pretty nice to see. You can hear how rough the road is. The car's squeaking all over the place. It's not really that great. The roads in town are not that good either. But it's nice for if you like winter, and we do. Of course, as we get older, it gets a little harder to deal with. But beautiful right in here. We like the canopy that's over top of the road. Right, hon? Yeah. Sally's been doing pretty good herself. A little slowed down this cold weather. Slows us both down a little bit. But I'm hoping to get uh, this spring a bunch of uh, pine logs if I can and get them cut. like this you need to have four wheel drive and you need to have good tires. And of course you have to know where the gut the gullies are on the sides of the road because you get stuck real quick. Like on this road from here up for about a half a mile, there's nothing on the right-hand side. But on the left-hand side, you drive over there, you're going in, you're gonna get stuck. I'm gonna have to pull over so that guy can get by. Yeah, 
really plowed this road good because the township never plows it this wide. The guy is afraid to drive into the ditch. I mean, I don't blame him, but I'm just saying, this guy here, he has been plowing for the gas company. He just must have a plow that extends past the truck pretty much. But anyway, they're doing really a good, nice wide job. Two cars can get by you pretty good. Well, just so you know, Sally and I are doing good. We don't have any problems except the cold weather. And uh, it's just the way it is in winter time here. I'll be getting back to making videos for the sawmill as soon as I can. But for right now, it's covered in snow and I'm not going to be doing anything for the rest of the winter over there. I was saying up this road here is where 20, 22 deer were in the middle of the pipeline the other day. And right here on this hill, three trucks so far couldn't make it up and ended up backing down here into the pole. Have a good one, guys. Bye.